Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to fix the stupid HD face problem where the faces on the rigs or characters are all pixely. But yeah, I don't wanna really uh, talk about anything before we get into the video or waste your time, so let's just get right into the video. So, I've been experiencing this problem for a very long time and I did some digging on the internet, but all I could find was like complaining on the dev forum about faces on R6 being very low quality and how on R15 it's better quality. The solution that was found was to do some Blender stuff but that's pretty advanced and I don't think it would really help with animations. So after that, uh, a few months after, I was trying to find a solution in the studio and I came across this little local script file or whatever you want to call it inside of the Roblox filmmaking community face pack and it's telling you that you don't have to use the default rigs on in the pack anymore because that's how you used to get HD faces. But in the local script, it tells you that there is this plugin that was created to help with HD faces. And basically how it works is, first of all, what you want to do is you want to get the plugin. The link will be in the description. After you get the plugin installed, you can go into Roblox Studio and you see that there are three features in the plugin. Now I'm going to explain to you what those three features are. They're very useful. So the first feature I want to talk about is the hat feature. Basically, you want to select whatever character you want to animate and then you, when you click the hat symbol, it will sort all the hats inside of the rig that you selected into a folder and what that's useful for is let's just say you want the character take to take off its mask or something since it's just a mesh part now it would be much easier to do uh the second feature is you click it and it just loads in the roblox filmmaking community faces so you don't really have to go into your uh downloaded toolbox so that's really useful now this is why you clicked on the video so basically you want to click the rig that you wanna make the faces HD. All you wanna do from there is click that little noob head thing. And what it does is it inserts uh, like an HD face thing. So what you wanna do is you wanna go into the rig at that point and you can see that when you click on the drop down for head, it's got all the stuff, but then it also has a folder for the past faces in there. You can use that if you want. But then there's also the face decals in there. You know how I explained before how you used to have to use the rigging from the actual model with the faces in it. But basically what the plugin does is it in actually inserts the whole welded HD face into the rig. And what you can do from there is just customize the face as you want it to. And it will be HD. So thank you for watching. If this helped you then please subscribe because it motivates me to make more animations and videos that could help you. And uh, yeah, have a nice day. As always, stay healthy, stay hydrated, and see you next time.